turn now to the war in Ukraine tonight. The Kremlin seeing the biggest drone attack yet inside Russia. Four Russian military planes destroyed. Russia now retaliating. And ABC's Britt Klenet in Ukraine for us. Tonight, Ukraine unleashing its most widespread drone attacks inside Russia since the war began. Seen in footage posted online. This airbase in Peskov, one of several military targets across at least six regions. Video circulating on social media showing thick smoke rising above the facility. At least four military planes destroyed. A fuel depot and military supply factory also struck. Russia today retaliating in the biggest attack on Kyiv since spring with a barrage of drones and missiles. The debris killing at least two people. Crews hosing down the smoldering wreckage in this neighborhood. And residents picking up the pieces after missile fragments and fiery debris rained down on their homes. Tonight, Moscow vowing drone attacks on Russian soil will not go unpunished. But Ukraine now signaling it is willing to hit Russia where it's most vulnerable, a tactic Ukraine's spy chief warned about months ago. Do you think there'll be more? I think so. Yeah, more attacks inside Russia, deep inside Russia? Deeper and deeper. David, the White House says Russia is working with North Korea on potential arms deals to use in its war here in Ukraine. Meanwhile, on those drone attacks in Russia, a Kremlin propagandist on state TV, he had some rare criticism saying, if we can't cope with drones, how will we cope with F-16s? David. It's a big question. Britt Clement in Kiev for us. Britt, thank you as always. <laughs> Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.